Well, it's shaping up to be a congested travel week for Thanksgiving next week. A record number of Americans are expected to travel this year, according to AAA. ABC's Zareen Shaw has more on what you can expect. Thanksgiving is always a popular time to travel, but this year may see the most travelers yet. AAA projecting nearly 80 million Americans will travel 50 miles or more between Tuesday, November 26th and Monday, December 2nd. It is going to set records. Uh, last year, 2023 was another record setting year, but we're surpassing that by over 2.1%, which equates to about 1.7 million people traveling domestically. Most of those travelers will be driving, with a record 71.7 million people expected to get to their destinations by car, and they'll benefit from lower gas prices this year compared to last. We're looking at an average of $3.26 this holiday season, and we may even see $3 a gallon by Thanksgiving, which is the lowest it's been since 2021. Air travel also forecasted to set a new record. So we're going to see an increase of 2.1% versus last year, bringing that in around 5.8 million people flying this holiday season. And another record, nearly 2.3 million people projected to travel via other modes of transportation including trains, buses, and cruises. We are seeing a huge increase in cruises, up 20% over 2023. And a lot of that has to do with the fact that cruises were really the last ones to start back up post-COVID. If you'll be hitting the road for Thanksgiving, the day before Thanksgiving is expected to be the busiest day to head out. Anytime you can leave on Thanksgiving itself and you start early in the morning and get to your destination, that is when you're gonna find the optimal time to be on the road. When coming home, Sunday evening is expected to be the busiest. If you're renting a car, experts say to reserve ahead of time and arrive early to pick it up. There may be long lines. And if you're flying, download the airline's app to check your flight status before heading to the airport. Reserve parking in advance and get there early to account for longer lines at security. Zoreen Shah, ABC News, Los Angeles. And as mentioned, gas prices are at a low right now, more than 25 cents lower than this time last year. The average Kentucky price is $2.75 a gallon, lower than the U.S. average. Quite a bit lower, Ben Pine, and that's some good news you can use starting your Monday off. Hey, 